Matt, your thoughts on a quite disastrous afternoon here? Yeah, yeah. Um, certainly a disastrous 45 minutes. I thought. Um, I thought when you come here, you know you're going to have to uh, weather the storm that they put in front of you. I don't think we could go. Um, we couldn't have hammered that home any more than we did in terms of, well, you, you know what you're going to come up against. You're going to have to win first balls. If you can't win first balls, you've got to do really well on your second balls, um, especially in our penalty area. Uh, and you've got to be good from set plays. So we're, I think, yeah, we're 2-0 down off a central free kick and then a long throw where it's not about the first one, it's about the second one that, that happens in terms of um, you're going to come up against people in your careers that are bigger than you. Uh, and and at times stronger than you. Um, you very, very rarely see that first contact on some of the things score. It's that second thing, what do we do after it once it bounces around? And we weren't there for them second them second contacts today. Um, and uh, and then we weren't there in the, the key moments at the other end, you know. We had uh, plenty of chances, especially in that first half, uh, while the game was 1-0, 2-0. There was loads of chances for us, but uh, we didn't take them. Um, so, both sides of the game weren't there for us today. We needed to, um, we needed to, to defend our penalty area um, collectively, uh, like our lives depended on it, to then allow us to build ourselves into the game. The other side of the things for me was as well, and especially in that first half, um, we, and this is the way they want you to play the game. Uh, they want you to then become what they are. Uh, and we didn't pass the ball at all well enough, uh, didn't take that extra touch well enough, um, but hey, listen, goals change games with it and, and when you're 1-0 down, 2-0 down, 3-0 down early, um, you have got to show some real character uh, and unfortunately today in that first half we were the other side of, uh, of, of who we are and what we are um, and it can't happen again. It's an inexcusable first half to go in at you know, 4-0 down, have you made it clear to the group that that's just not an acceptable kind of performance? What do you think, Tom? Do you think I've made it clear to the group? Yeah, of course I've made it clear to the group. We're there, all, and by the way, the group know that that's unacceptable. Um, so uh, we, there's no hiding place from that. Uh, how can that be deemed as anything but unacceptable? Um, for me, what's important to, to make sure is that um, as long as I've been playing and being involved and managing in this game, uh, no player has ever meant to put in a performance like that. So going in there and and telling them how poor they are, it never, it never did anything for me, and I'm pretty sure it won't do anything for them. What I've made crystal clear with them is that that never happens again, um, uh, and uh, and now it'll be down to us to put that reaction right and make that reaction. Um, it's it's at times like this, it's great. There's a game on Tuesday, uh, and you can um, we have to. We have to now put all of our positive energy into we've got to be better on Tuesday and we've got to win the next one. We need to get their good feelings back uh, off what the back is. Um, I, j I didn't see that first 45 minutes coming. That's ultimately the, sh the little bit of shell shot to it because I think, um, as I say, there were plenty of chances for us. We just couldn't defend our penalty area uh, against bigger lads than us. That, that's what it was. That's the crux of the matter. We couldn't defend our penalty area against lads that are bigger than, than our lads. and. And, uh, and that has to, with some na naive defending at times, so that has to be, um, that has to be eradicated. A couple of changes made to start the game off. Freddie on the bench, is he all right? Yeah, Freddie's, yeah. <laughs> Freddie, he, he felt his hamstring, um, so we were touch and go with him in, in many ways. So um, yeah, that's, that's Freddie. So, and then obviously we, yeah, so we couldn't bring him on because he, yeah, of his hamstring. So. Um, and I think it was important that I didn't want to push him because, uh, especially after that first half, we knew the game was where the game was. Um, it was about showing a response in the second half and, and, and showing a bit of respect for ourselves in the second half, uh, which at times I think we did. Naturally, when you're 4-0 down, it's difficult. Um, but in terms of Fred, yeah, he felt his hamstring, so we, uh, we couldn't take any risks on him. Like you've just said, you've got a game on Tuesday now. Got to put this one behind us very quickly and focus completely on that game against Forest Green. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's the only way you do it anyway, but uh, the, the, of course that's the only way you do it, it's the only way I work. I think it's important that um, that, uh, that there is a response uh, and there's a response on, on Tuesday to to some sore heads in there, you know, there's, there's, a, there's some hurting players and hurting staff in there at the moment and collectively 
which we will. Um, we have to get that good feeling back uh, going into two home games that we've got coming up. Uh, certainly on Tuesday night and then certainly on the following Saturday. We need to get that good feeling back into us um, and just see this for what I think, you know, an anomaly in the season, uh, uh, an incredibly disappointing first half. Um, and we just have to see that as a bit of a, a wake up call. Can't defend like that in our penalty area. A learning experience. Can't defend like that in our penalty area when you come to a place like this. And we have to make sure that it doesn't happen again. On a final note, I think there was 275 travelling fans a message for them yeah yeah well of, of course um, but firstly thanks for coming and supporting we quite clearly wouldn't, didn't want to get, uh, send them home um, off the back of the, the, the way that especially that first half was um, again the support we've had has been fantastic all season we didn't give them anything at all to, to shout about today um, and it's up to us to put that right